Shore program and represents the Broadmoor well Skating done. Club in Colorado Springs, Colorado. Here is Brandon Morose. Next up, the Broadmoor Skating Club in Colorado. Brandon Morose was in ninth place after the short program. As we mentioned in the short program, he's somebody who has the ability to do multiple quads. He's done he's done pretty much all of them. He's done quad lutz. He's done quad zell. He's done a quad do. He's done quad loops. He's done all these things. And in the short program, he showed that with a beautiful quad triple. But there's a lot of jump boxes in this long program. You got to hit a good majority of them to be in the mix. So, there it is again. <laughs> the ease with which these guys do these now is unbelievable. That's, you know, that's seven rotations in the air. Seven rotations in under a second and a half. momentum and how much torque is on that takeoff when you see a double and it just floats out of the air. When they have that much torque on a quad, fly out of the air when you do a double. talk about the men's long program is really sometimes being like a minefield. So many difficult elements and you just have to tiptoe your way through them. Any one of them, you know, being so difficult, any one of them can trip you up.
Brandon Rose. We've been talking all week just how difficult the elements that the guys are doing now are. Uh, you know, Ilya Kulik, not too long ago at the Olympics in 1998, it was like that was the first big Olympic quad moment, and he landed one. And, and now you have guys that, I mean, Brandon's in ninth after the short program. He did two beautifully clean quad triples, one in the short and one in the free skate. And he's down, you know, in the ninth place position. That just shows you how progressively this sport has just gotten technically more and more difficult. And the expectations are so much higher. And really, it also shows the importance of every single movement on the ice, everything resulting in points as you try to build up those pro programs strategically, right? And you talk about, you know, the, the difficulty of the quad, too. It's, I mean, think about what this is. It's somebody skating, flying across the ice at 20 miles an hour on one-eighth inch wide piece of steel, jumping up and rotating four times. And, oh, by the way, as soon as you land on one foot, Four, time, four rotations. you got to go right back up in the air again and do a triple. Oh, did I mention you have to do it to the music and um, you have to have a smile on your face and make it look easy. <laughs> and that looks pretty easy. Quad toe, good speed, triple toe. Oh, yeah, and it's done on the most uh, slippery surface known to man. It's on ice. It's not like it's done on the ground. <laughs> Let's add another factor to it. His free skate, 138.12. The total score, 208.69. And he is currently in second place. So 138.12 for the free skate of Brandon Moreau's gives him 208.69.